So terribly sorry. I, I'm, I'm, I'm terribly embarrassed, really. My dear boy, a bit rough, but never mind. No harm done. A day or two ago, the story I must tell. I went out on the snow, and on my back I fell. A gent was riding by in a one-horse open sleigh. He laughed as there I sprawling lie, but quickly drove away. Well, look what we have here. I see Tom's sleigh has let him down again. Miss Fanny, it appears you are in need of assistance. I can offer you a far more comfortable ride. I'm sure we can get Miss Fanny home before nightfall. <laughs> Please step this way, my dear. <laughs> Thank you, George. It really is very kind of you. I should be frozen otherwise. I say, what an unpleasant man. Dear, dear, 
However shall we get home without catching our death? Oh no, I never meant anyone to come to any grief. his speed. Hitch him to an open sleigh and crack, you'll take the lead. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Madam, allow me to assist. Why, why, thank you, sir. Giddy up, boy. snow has chilled me right through to the bone. Yes, right through to the bone. Whatever shall we do, I don't know. Um, oh, I... Mm, quite dreadful. We look positively bedraggled. What must the other guests think? I do hope Tom Slay wasn't too badly damaged. We were going rather fast. Mm. Ah, say, just look at that group over there. I believe Tom and his rickety old sleigh are to blame. They must have had another upset. Have you heard about the sleigh race tomorrow? Yes, I have. I do hope Tom is fully prepared. Oh. Well, I can't see what chance Tom stands against George's sleigh. It's quite preposterous that Tom should enter to the sleigh race. Oh. Especially against George. I agree. Oh. George's sleigh is far superior to Tom's. Tom really has no hope. <laughs> the race will be over before you've reached the end of the square. I'll make sure you don't suffer too long. I wouldn't be too happy with Tom's old sleigh up behind me. <laughs> to the heart of them. But what can we do? Double! We must...
must speak with you. Babel, if Tom doesn't win, George will surely capture the heart of Fanny. Ah. Tom will be so very upset. I wish we could find a way of making sure that Tom wins the race and I don't trust that George. Hmm. Gentlemen, <laughs> I am very honored to welcome you to this most prestigious event, the one we have all been waiting for, the annual village sleigh race. Thank you, thank you. This year, we have two competitors, Tom <laughs> and George. Yeah, boy. The competitors, as you know, must complete one lap of the village in Jordan, keeping to the marked routes. There should be no jostling and absolutely no shortcuts. On your marks, get set, go! May the best man win! Catch me now. I'm sure there should be a shortcut by way of the lake somewhere off this road. <laughs> but where? Ah, ah. As always, I am gifted with supreme good fortune. This way they stand no chance, even if they find out I have deceived them. He's so slow, he'll never know if I turn this sign around to face ah, the long route. I'll take the shortcut myself. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot lose. Miss Fanny Bright will surely now be mine. I can't wait to see her face as I cross the finish line. <laughs> Oh, 
lucky. I pointed the sign towards the long road. Oh, wow. This shortcut has become far more hazardous than I anticipated. Oh, wow, wow. Quick! We must follow these signs or else we'll get lost! Hurry, Tom! Hmm. But which way is the right way to go? Because if we take the wrong route, we'll certainly be disqualified. We have got to follow the signs. There are only guidance. The mayor will be sure to eliminate George from the race when he sees that he's cheated. Yes, sir, he will. But uh, how will he find out? For the time being, we must be as quick as we can and stick to the route. Agreed? Congratulations, Tom. Oh, I misjudged you. Please forgive me. <laughs> I'm so humiliated. What am I going to tell my family and friends? I'll never live this down. As you all know, Tom is the first to cross the finish line and is therefore winner of this year's Christmas sleigh race. And as in previous years, the prize for winning is this beautiful new sleigh. I'm not sure how young George comes to be so wet. There is no lake on the route of the race, so I can only assume he got lost. However, it is nearly nightfall. Let us all go to the village hall and celebrate Christmas Eve. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun 
fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Oh, jingle bells. 